Hi everyone, it's Dixon here. In this video, I'm going to review the Logitech C920 webcam. It's been out for a while now, but remains popular due to its video quality and features available, whilst being a more affordable price. So is it still worth buying in 2021? Let's take a look and find out. The C920 looks much better in person than online. It feels robust in your hands, and when placed on top of your monitor, it looks professional and blends in with other equipment nicely. The lens is very prominent in the centre, but looks smart, and I really like the subtle blue lights which illuminate when the camera is active. The two grills either side for the microphones are a little coarse looking, but those holes are obviously there so that they can pick up your voice clearly. More on that later. Positioning the webcam is very simple. Unfold and adjust the stand until you can secure a solid fit. The little lip on the front adds further stability, although it does block a little screen visibility, not much, but noticeable on monitors with thin bezels. The C920 offers 1080p at 30 frames per second, or 720p at 30 frames per second, combined with a 78 degree field of view. This means you'll have plenty of space to move around without the risk of becoming lost off screen. It's a three megapixel camera, which isn't anything huge, but it seems to do the trick. Out of the box, the quality of the video is impressive. The colour and contrast appear natural, so your skin and other colours don't appear oversaturated and unrealistic. With my setup, exposure can be an issue, as I have a lot of light behind me coming from the window. Luckily, with the camera settings app, it's easy to adjust this, along with the other settings to ensure you have a setup which you prefer. If you do go ahead and adjust the brightness, I found that it's difficult to adjust the contrast to complement the extra light meaning the video quality can appear a little washed out if you adjust it too much. I like the widescreen setting and the anti-flicker modes are useful with LED lighting equipment such as a softbox light. The autofocus works well 99% of the time, although I have noticed a few times where it becomes blurred for a few seconds when I've moved around. It doesn't appear to be a common occurrence though. I've tested the Logitech camera settings app on both my MacBook Air M1 as well as Windows 10 and it works without any issues. One of the biggest issues with webcams is how they perform with low light settings. My MacBook Air and iPad Pro suffer massively from this. With the C920, I'm pleased with how well it performs in low light. Not only because it remains decent quality, but also because the exposure remains natural, meaning you don't look like you've beamed up to heaven as a result of the increased exposure. The MacBook and iPad fall far short when compared with the C920 webcam. So for a price of 60 pounds here in the UK, you can significantly improve your video call quality. The microphone quality is good enough for your video calls in that your voice will be clear, although in my opinion it does sound a little distant and slightly muffled when compared with my Jabra headset. I therefore still recommend the use of a separate microphone or headset if higher quality is important for you. Also, note that this webcam does not have built-in speakers, so audio will play back via your device speakers by default. On top of the camera settings app, Logitech also offer Logitech Capture, designed for streaming, so if this is something you're interested in, this is a great feature on offer. You can choose the video quality, add overlay text, record from multiple sources, and have an array of tools available to customise the video style with filters and borders. However, the Capture app will not work at all on my MacBook Air M1, and after looking around online, it seems that Logitech still don't offer support, even after nearly a year something to be aware of. I don't do any live streaming, so haven't tested the app in full, but the various settings all appear to work well in Windows 10. So in summary, the Logitech C920 webcam offers fantastic value for money, and whilst there are a few nuances, it's largely a really effective, well-made webcam, which is far superior to a lot of the standard webcams built into your devices, such as a MacBook or iPad. A quick reminder to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments down below, happy to answer them. Otherwise, thanks very much for watching and I'll see you soon.